Welcome back to Infigam friends. In this video, we will be solving another very very interesting question from radical equations for the real values of x. So let's get started by considering power 4 both sides. So we can cancel 4th root with power 4 in RHS. So I can write x power 4 will be equal to 4x plus 1 times 5x minus 1 times 6x plus 1 times 7x minus 1 over 2 times 4 is 8, 8 times 7 56, 56 times 9 504. Now we will multiply both sides with 504. So we will get 504x power 4 equal to 4x plus 1 times 5x minus 1 times 6x plus 1 times 7x minus 1. If I will plug in x equal to 0 to our equation, let's check whether it will satisfy or not. So LHS will become 504 times 0 power 4 is 0 equal to 4 times 0 plus 1. So 1, 5 times 0 minus 1. So minus 1. 6 times 0 plus 1, 1. 7 times 0 minus 1, minus 1. So this side we will get 1. LHS is 0, RHS is 1, which is not equal. So we can conclude x cannot be 0 for our equation. Now I will divide both sides by x power 4. So let's divide here. x power 4. So here I will divide with x, x, x and x. Now from LHS we can cancel x power 4 from numerator and denominator. So I can write our equation 504 equal to, let's divide, I will write 4 plus 1 over x, 5 minus 1 over x, 6 plus 1 over x, 7 minus 1 over x. Now we can use substitution. 1 over x we can consider a. So I will write our equation once. Now let us assume 1 over x equal to a. So our equation will write a plus 4 times 5 minus a times 6 plus a times 7 minus a equal to 504. Now I will take minus 1 common from this bracket and minus 1 common from this bracket. So I can write a plus 4 times minus 1 is common. In the bracket we can write a minus 5. Then we have 6 plus a or a plus 6. Now here I will take minus 1 common out. So in the bracket we can write a minus 7 equal to 504. Now this minus 1 times minus 1 will give us plus 1. So we will be writing finally a plus 4 times a minus 5 times a plus 6 times a minus 7 equal to 504. Now I will consider these two brackets all together and these two brackets all together as 4 minus 5 equal to 6 minus 7. Let me write here. But before that friends, if you are an Olympiad aspirant, or planning to do preparation for SOF, Crest, Unica, Silver Zone, Asset, ITO, Hummingbird from Gate 2 to Grade 10, then Olympiad Success offers you live interactive classes, QIQs, tests and many more. Please check out the description box for further details and use referral code GAN15 to get 15% discount. Let's come back to our problem. Now I will write our equation once. So equation will be a plus 4 
times a minus 5 then a plus 6 then a minus 7 equal to 504 let's multiply these two brackets and these two brackets so i'll be writing a square minus a minus 20 and here i will be writing a square minus a minus 42 equal to 504 now we can write a square minus a minus 31 plus 11 is minus 20 if i will add these two will give us minus 20 here i will be writing a square minus a minus 31 minus 11 if i will add these two we will get negative 42 equal to 504 now think this is a and consider 11 as b then this is a plus b a minus b so we can use difference of two squares formula a square minus a minus 31 whole square minus 11 whole square equal to 504 or we can write a square minus a minus 31 whole square minus 121 equal to 504 now i will add 121 to both sides so i will write plus 1 to 1 plus 1 to 1 so we will get a square minus a minus 31 whole square equal to 504 plus 121 625 which is a square of 25 let me write here a square minus a minus 31 whole square equal to 25 whole square now we can consider a square root both sides so we will get a square minus a minus 31 equal to plus minus 25 so i can write two equations from here one with plus 25 and other with negative 25 as rhs minus 25 so from first equation i will be getting a square minus a minus 56 equal to 0 and from second equation i will be getting a square minus a minus 6 equal to 0 now we can use quadratic formula or factorization method so we will get factors a plus 7 times a minus 8 here and a plus 2 times a minus 3 here so from first equation i will be getting a plus 7 will be 0 or a minus 8 will be 0 and from here i will be writing a plus 2 will be 0 and a minus 3 will be 0 so overall we'll have a equal to negative 7 8 negative 2 3 so here we have four solutions for the value of a a was our substitution let me write here a equal to minus 7 8 minus 2 3 so i can write our substitution was 1 over x equal to a so i can write here 1 over a value which will be equal to x so i can write minus 1 over 7 1 over 8 minus 1 over 2 and 1 over 3 now we will talk about which solution we are going to accept or which we should reject so i will write our equation x equal to fourth root of 4x plus 1 over 2 times 5x minus 1 over 4 
times 6x plus 1 over 7 times 7x minus 1 over 9. So first of all, we can write x must be positive for real x, real solutions. And this radicant also be positive for real solutions. So I will write condition. We will write here x must be less than minus 1 by 4. x should be in the interval minus 1 by 6 to 1 by 7. And third condition will write x should be greater than 1 over 5. If I will consider intersection of both the conditions from LHS and RHS, we will get x must be in the interval 0 to 1 over 7. And our answer should be in the interval 1 over 5 to infinity. So once we are having x in these intervals, then we will say our solution will be real. So I will cancel minus 1 over 7. I will cancel minus 1 over 2 because x negative is not possible. Let me write here. So I will write x equal to 1 over 3 and 1 over 8, which we can cross examine easily. 1 over 3 is greater than 1 over 5. So this will be accepted and 1 over 8 is less than 1 over 7. So this solution we will accept. So our final answer for this problem would be 1 over 3 and 1 over 8. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.